So because I didn't really have any video ideas for today, I wanted to talk about how I got into f This video will, will be about how I got into flipping. It basically started off, I was like 12 years old, watching Extreme Flippers on YouTube. It's like a group of guys that do flips. They did trampolining and a little bit of free running. So I got into the flipping scene because of them. I started off in my backyard just trying to do flips, trying to progress. I was so motivated, like I just kept on, kept on tramping, like I didn't stop. So I, I started watching tutorials on YouTube, basically how to do a backflip, how to do a front flip, how to do a side flip, all that kind of stuff. And the more I trained and the more I put time in it, the more I saw the so after a while, I started getting into double backflips, double front flips, like the higher stuff. It just started getting a lot more fun than it even was. And me and my friends started making YouTube videos on a channel called Free Stylus and L. I want, I want to make a reaction to Free Stylus and L video soon, but not yet. So I saw my channel like grow a bit. We had some views, but. It wasn't really about the views for me, it just was about the fun of tramping, being with friends. We had so much fun times on the trampoline. And then after tramping for like one and a half years, I started getting into tricking. For the ones that don't know what tricking is, tricking is uh, martial arts. Tricking is it called actually. It is a sport where you like combine kicks, flips, twists, everything and make it one yeah basically just combine them and do stuff so getting into tricking was very hard because I came from trampolining and I think because of doing trampolining a lot like you're used to bounce yourself with tricking it's not that easy you're on ground nothing bounces you so my motivation for tramp lowered down and my motivation for tricking got up a couple months I started like seeing my progress in tricking and just got more and more my motivation just keep, kept on going and it was just so much fun for me at this time I al almost fully quit a tramping like tramp was just not that fun for me anymore because I was like I was thinking like okay so I did triple backflips I did crazy stuff I don't really want to do anything more because it would just get very dangerous that was my opinion so yeah that's why I started tricking just something new 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 experiences Meeting new people was just so much fun to me. And after tricking for a while, like one year, I was like, I miss tramping. So I started getting into tramping and that started to like get fun for me as well. It just started having crazy sessions, doing crazy stuff again. and. I just did tramping and tricking both of them and now I'm here just doing tramping and tricking injuries have been holding me back though like didn't have any injuries at first but now like I think it's because I'm like maybe growing a lot it's just I just got a lot of them so for the people that want to get into flips my advice is Practicing is key, like consistency and practicing is just key, like I think I got all my tricks and all my flips because I just practice so much. Then my second tip is search for YouTube tutorials, that's like, there are like so many out there that just help so much, like, so yeah, like YouTube tutorials are just so, so helpful, like they help me so much, me and my friends just... <laughs> oh, Tom just fell on the ice. Okay, the tips and tricks they give you in these videos, they're just so helpful. My third tip for the ones that want to start doing flips is... Have fun doing it, because if you don't have fun doing it, like, it won't work out. If you put time in it, it will work out. If you keep having motivation for it, it will work out. Like. You may not be the best, like I'm not the best, definitely not. There are so many crazy G trampers, trickers out there, but like having fun with it and just trying your hardest to do the stuff is like very important. Well, what I can remember for like for the first 
two months of starting tricking and tramping, I didn't really have a lot of fun doing it. It was just, I wanted to keep going because I wanted to achieve what I was like setting. I, I set goals and I wanted to achieve them. And after I just worked so hard for it, it happened and I got better and yeah. That's basically my journey in trampolining and tricking since 2013, I think. So yeah. All right, guys, I know this video is very different from my other videos, but I just felt like talking about this and for people that are new to my channel just and want to get into flips and want to know about my journey through flips, I just wanted to tell you guys about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, share, and a comment. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.